today. So glad you could connect with me because today we're talking about a little bit about my own personal style. Um, and I just wanted to share with you some things that I've been wearing that I have found in our stores that I personally am loving and I'm adding them to my own closet, okay? So first off, I wanna let you know that I travel quite a bit for work um, and play. Um, so I always wanna have outfits that are really comfortable that I can easily travel in, um, that easily go with other things within my suitcase so I can kind of mix and match a little bit like a capsule wardrobe. So I'm gonna start with this little number from LNA. Now, she reads like a jumpsuit, and you know me, I like a one and done where it all just kind of works together, but in reality, these are two pieces, okay? So you've got the drawstring pants with a little bit of a jogger um, bottom on here, and then also the top has a little bit of a drawstring. So when you do those two drawstrings together, that's what gives you that kind of hourglass shape and kind of makes it look more like a jumpsuit. When I style it, I always pop a collar, that's just me. That elevates your everyday style just a little bit and it sets you apart from others, okay? I always push up my sleeves or I'm cuffing or I'm rolling, just adding a little movement to that, um, which adds dimension and again, just elevates it from your everyday look. I paired these with these amazing shoes. We just started carrying this, they're called Beaks, okay? They are handmade leather sandals, I mean, they're amazing. They have these beautiful little gold grommets on them. They lace up the ankle a little bit. I love it when your jogger is drawing a little bit of attention to the smallest part of your body, which is your ankle. And then that little lace up, um, or sorry, the, the wrap up of the leather on that ankle draws attention to it too. So loving that. And I like the fact that they're flat. So as I'm running in an airport, that kind of thing, it's very comfortable on my feet, all right? Now, accessories. I'm all about accessories because I think that really pulls a very basic look together. I'm obsessed with turquoise right now. <laughs> so this little turquoise necklace is one of my favorites. Um, this one is by Goriana. And then this beautiful little ring that kind of pairs back as far as popping that turquoise color. It's a little bit unexpected, but I like that, okay? Um, a gold hoop earring is pretty much what I wear almost every day. I do shake it up a little bit, but oftentimes a gold hoop is just what is clean and simple for me, okay? Now, with travel, I'm always gonna need a bag that I can easily tuck under. I fly commercial, so I need that tuck under that front seat all the time. We have some beautiful bags. Um, the one I'm gonna show you is actually by Cleo Bella. She's got nice soft sides, so it carries everything that I need, again, personally or professionally, my laptop, all my snacks, my such have snacks, magazines, the whole thing. Another thing with this that I love is there is a coordinating like overnight travel case that you can purchase as well. I kind of like that matchy matchy sometimes because it just keeps it really clean and simple. Um, this one has a, po a little pocket on the front to hold any you know quick little uh, things you need to grab like your cell phone or whatever, throw it over your shoulder and you're ready to go. Remember that great little LNA top that I had with those last set of pants that kind of look like a little bit of a jumpsuit? Keeping the same LNA top, right? I paired this with these great Agledy pants. Okay, Agledy is a brand that I personally love. I have a ton of it in my closet. Sometimes you just find that brand that is just mm, on for you. Agledy's one for me. Now, these I will tell you, they're kind of have a look, almost like a little brown stone color, which I really enjoy. And then it has a lot of little detailing all around as far as the stitching and the patches and that kind of thing. It kind of peers back to that little cargo look that we're going to for spring into summer. And I'm all about a great trend like that. Another thing I love about Eagle D is the length. You all know that I'm 5'9", so I struggle sometimes with finding the right length of pants. I love Eagle D because these especially have that little bit of length so that I can really have fun with it and play with it and roll it up a little bit. When I roll it on the bottom, when I style it, I don't get too crisp with the cuff. I kind of leave it a little bit messy, intentionally unintentioned, does that make sense? So again, it just elevates that everyday casual that you're going for and sets your outfit a little bit apart, all right? Um, again, with the accessories, because I really feel an accessory pulls everything together. Bandanas, you've heard me talk about bandanas before. You can wear them on your wrist, you can wear them on your waist, you can wear them around a great hat, you can put them around your neck. So many fun ways to add this, you can add it to a bag. It's just that little pattern that takes a monochromatic outfit like what I'm wearing to the next level, okay? This one, of course, I paired as, uh, as a little belt around my waist, but again, many options of how you can wear that. 
When it comes to jewelry, I do sometimes like a really monochromatic look, kind of what I have on now. So I kept the jewelry real simple too. I switched to this little Goriana necklace with a little tiny tag at the bottom. And then I kept on those hoop earrings because like I said, nine times out of a 10, that's what I'm wearing is a gold hoop, okay? Um, shoes, the Corkies, they're of they're a brand that I can wear all day long. I am on my feet eight, nine hours a day. I can walk on concrete floors and it feels so good, believe it or not. So this one again has kind of like that typical Corky's cushion with the beautiful wood heel. And then it has this beautiful leather strap across the top. I love to show a little bit of your toes because we're headed from spring into summer. And these are really easy to slide on your feet. Now, the bags, because I love a good bag all the time. Um, this one that I'm going to show you is from Parker Clay. The tone in her is very similar to the tone that's going on in your shoe, okay? So again, try to keep it matching a little bit. Sometimes I like to mix, but with the monochromatic, I kind of want them to balance out a little bit. What I love about Parker Clay is when you, when you carry her, the more distressed and worn in she gets, the better it is, the better it gets as time goes on, okay? So you want a little bit of that distressing. You kind of want that to get a little bit softer. It's gonna become your best friend, this bag, I promise you. I love the fact that it can be a tote because these little this little strap can come off. It can be a tote, it can also be a shoulder bag. Sometimes even if I'm carrying it as a tote, I still like to keep that handle on because again, it just adds movement to everything, all right? So hopefully you enjoyed that outfit. I'll be back with one more. You know how I roll, my favorite outfit is always the last. Love all the pieces that we have that can mix and match together, and that's including these pieces right here, okay? This one is, first of all, a little denim shirt by Citizens of Humanity. It's called the Kayla Shrunken. It's the perfect thing that you're gonna want in your closet because a denim shirt goes with everything. Denim on denim is still a trend that we're leaning into. These are by Paige. Love the distressing at the bottom. It brings, again, attention to that ankle, which is the smallest part of your leg. And I paired it with this great belt. This Guanabana belt is really what pulls the whole outfit together because she's, this has the browns, it has the blacks, and honestly draws attention, again, to your waist and gives you a shape if you're more like rectangle shape body, okay? So that's gonna draw attention there. The jacket. I can't even with the jacket. This is by Blank NYC. This trench is amazing. I style it a little bit with the belt tied in the back, so it keeps it a little more casual, but again, elevating your everyday. I always pull out that um, denim or whatever layer button down I have underneath and intentionally kind of just make it look a little bit messier, push it up a little bit, again, just to keep it a little, little movement going on in your outfitting. And then, um, uh, very simple, this is a Goriana, Goriana necklace. I kept those gold hoops again. And then at the very last but not least are these great corkies that I paired it with. It pulls a little bit of the black out that's in your belt and a little bit of black in the buttons everything together my friend I'm gonna take the jacket off just for a second because I want to talk about denim on denim it's a trend that is still continuing I love it I want to tell you do not overthink it okay keep it simple it's fine if you do light with light it's fine if you do dark with dark you do not have to have it too matchy you don't have to have dark on the top light on the bottom or vice versa whatever works for you is good to go my friend anything goes with denim on denim all right Thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. Love sharing what's in my closet and what I'm wearing with you. Come into our stores. We have so much more to show you.